always do unboxing. We always complain that we don't have enough space in the box, but Fate Jai did it up on this one. He made him load this box. Oh yeah, and we got a really special golden fish right here. Go ahead, let's show everybody. Check this out. <laughs> Yay! He doesn't want to talk. Just Hi. kidding. <laughs> Let's go. We have a lot of boxes from Colombia. As you can see, there's walls of boxes behind over you over there and a couple more. But today's a special day. Because yeah, we got two shipments today. Oh, okay. okay. The second shipment. <laughs> this is a Spartan. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Um, so what do you think, bro, about this shipment? I think we're kind of overloaded a bit honestly but we got what three shipments coming this week so this is number one we got another one tonight and another one on saturday i'm a little disappointed because i ordered some big fish and I, I see little boxes so it didn't come in but i still think we have a lot of cool stuff here so without any further ado mr fage all right let's go fage is answering a phone call but we can't wait anymore i i am too excited for the shipment so we're just gonna get started I just want to say shout out to Fejai for ordering a new table finally because we got it, we got rid of those plastic old tables. This is actually stainless steel with wheels. You know what I'm saying? We're growing in life. We're getting there. Box number 22. It's your Ooh, favorite number? Yeah. See, I know something about you. <laughs> Insulation. Looking pretty good. Okay. On, bro. All right. All right. Let's see what we got here. See, oh, there's no rubber band on this bag. I don't know. Two bags. Two bags of cor cor <laughs> Corridoras. You ordered this, for guy. Oh, are these the panda? These are the Adolfoy. Adolfoy. Yeah. Really nice, pretty. Black, white, and then they're going to have a streak of gold right behind their eyes. It's really nice fish. So, I don't know if you guys noticed, the way we work here is I know monster, Fejai knows Everything else. Non-monster. Everything else. <laughs> true, true. But are you getting you getting knowledge on the monsters. Yeah, yeah, I am. Even salt water. You you're he's Slowly really good learning. at like keeping like stuff, remembering stuff. Alright, so but box number one, you think you could put more per bag or okay. we're gonna have to have a talk with this guy. <laughs> this is only what, 10, 20 fish in one whole box? It's supposed to be 40, so that's probably 20 right there. I told them to load it up, but oh well, sometimes they just don't listen. Alright, box number two. First box, well, you know, that was right, you, that was you. Something different. That was you. I looked at the list Sorry. already. This one was you. This is me? This is the one you added on at the last minute. But I, I did agree to it as well. Honestly, it's something different. it looks cool. It looks cool. And he said they're not aggressive. So we'll see. I, I've, I've always avoided this type of fish because they like to be fit nippers, but they look pretty cool. You see how they have that orange red line? It's a type of leperinus. But their mouth looks different than a normal leperinus though. Yeah, it looks a little sharper, but and for him to pack it like this also, and there's no yeah, fin no damage. Fin, I was looking at that too, yeah. so it's actually a really cool fish. When I saw the picture, it was like super dark with nice orange stripes. You don't see that color on fish very often. No, not you, you, to find orange on freshwater fish is very rare. They're a cool looking fish. I'm more into that orange color. But once we clear up the water, we'll show you guys again, then you'll see. All right, so box number two is to hit, let's go to box number three. So far, this has been one of our top sellers and we've been getting- Neon Patras. No, not Neons. What is it then? It's the Blue Phantoms, all right? Oh, blue, yeah, blue no, Phantom. you know what? They're actually very nice black ones. Looks to be a good size. Yeah, this particular box. Oh, no, these are the small ones. Okay. But that's a good size. This is a good size, yes. Uh, in the past, they've been coming in a touch too small. Can you see? What do you say, two and a half, three inches? Yeah, like two and a half. Some is three, yeah. These okay. are a little bit bigger. Yeah, so we got some nice little blue phantoms there. A lot of people like them. Some people like to do the green with the blue. Yeah, it's a nice combination. So this bag right here is a little bit bigger. These guys, I would say, are like three and a half to four inches. So we got a good variety of them. Really pretty fish. And phantoms, they get what, about six, seven inches max, right? Uh, I believe so, yeah. The biggest we've gotten was like maybe about six and a half, right? You guys are looking for blue phantom? Do we have green phantom in the shipment? Uh, yes, we do. 
All right, so you already know one of these boxes is going to be Green Phantom and uh, ready for another box. Oh, sorry, it was the bag. Guys, I feel like I'm doing all the work today. Look at this guy. He's over there trying to calculate what box to do, what fish to not to do. That's bullshit, dog. No, it's not. You do things systematically so you don't jam yourself up. This I don't way have we a sister. I know you don't. Oh, you don't have a sister? No. You want my brother? No. You want to do brother, brother medically? No, that's okay. Okay. What is this, Vijay? I don't know. Oh, this is a green panther. Oh, so we're just jumping. All right, guys, we're going to have to speed up the process here. They look pretty good. Yeah, these are the high fin ones. High fin green phantoms? Yeah. Okay. If you never had a green phantom or a blue phantom, let me show you what they look like. So these are the blue. You see, it's more of like a dark blue. You don't really see like a very, very bright blue. Unless they acclimate and they're feeling good in your tank, you guys see them. You can see some are more blue than others. So it really depends on how they acclimate. But the yellow ones, I mean, sorry, the green ones, you see it's almost like a greenish yellow. And the same thing, as soon as they acclimate, they'll get darker on the body, but it'll be a little more like a dark green. Still really pretty fish. I think if you have a uh, community fish, you can put the Leparinas, Corridoras, Plecos, they won't attack each other and they will live together. As far as I know, all, all Leparinas are aggressive, but these guys don't seem to be. So we'll, we'll keep an eye on them, but I don't see any fin damage and he kept them together in Colombia. So I think these guys are gonna be really pretty. I think these guys are gonna be really cool for a community tank. Baby, have you seen this before? Probably not. It's got your face. We got a lot of stuff to do today. My, I don't look forward to that. Honestly, dude, I don't know how boxers do it because I, I spar a little bit and I get like headaches. <laughs> it's, it's not fun, I'll tell you that. But I'll see you there, Joey. Boss, why are you laughing? I'm being serious. See, look at that face, man. Look real. I don't look, you know, angry and tough enough. He's being silly, right? You don't want some of these hands, bro. No, well, now I know. I just gotta pop you in the head, and you're gonna be like. That's true. All right. Enough joking around. Huh? That's not what's supposed to be in there. This is yellow tail barracudas. Yeah. What is that? Very tiny. But I can't tell. Are they red or yellow, Fajai? So yellow tail barracudas are kind of rare. You don't really see them very often. These guys actually get decent size too. But when they're that small, you got to feed them blood worms. Tiny little fish. I saw this guy flipping upside down, but I want to give him a chance. So I'm going to put him right here against the current. Hopefully he'll come back around. As I was saying, at this size, guppies, you know, even the mini monsters, there's small, the, the frozen food that we sell, they're small enough that you can chop it up and give it to these guys. But you can see, look, look how small their mouths are. Hey, bad girl, pick it up. I wasn't talking to your wife, it's only to my wife. Okay. He's a, I forgive him now. Hey Ryan, can you give this bag to Oi, please? Thank you. Thank you. That's not Oi. Huh? Uh, I want no. it. I want it. No. Oh, thank you so much. Good job, buddy. Hey, good job. Good at following instructions. You good? Yeah. All right. I got it. Yes. One more, one more time? Okay, I'll give you one more bag. Hold on, okay? All right, I don't even know what box this is anymore. But so far, all the fish came in pretty healthy, right? Yeah. It's a good shipment. And we are... It's Whose kid is that? Just I don't know. Over. These people, man. <laughs> they don't teach manners to their kids. It's crazy. It's crazy. All right, picture. Oh. I want to see how nice these... Oh, that's beautiful. When they're, when they're hidden like that... Is it a something illegal or something cool? Yeah, it's like, it could be like a big disappointment. <laughs> All right, let's find out right now. 50-50. Can you move a little bit so I can? Sure. Oh, it's not a disappointment, not but a it's, sideways. it's sideways. So where are we going? Another thing. Guys, this is, this is crazy. Real quick, 
I'm gonna try to save these guys. So I want you to just take a quick look. Look how big that is. Probably the biggest one we ever had. Why are you falling on top of me? Are you drunk? Did you give her anything to drink? Not yet. She's literally <laughs> falling on top of me. Dude, but did you see any or no? I saw, I peeked on this one. Look at this. This guy's big. I remember seeing in the video, but yeah, the bank. Look at that. Oh yeah, that good. Look That's at the like size, the size of your palm. Yeah. This is yeah, the baggest ones we ever had. The right. baggest ones that we ever had. You got that? The no. baggest ones we ever had. <laughs> Wait, I didn't say the biggest. You, you said the baggest. baggest. The, the biggest, biggest and, the and the baddest. Yep, exactly. Oh, uh, I see. <laughs> You're up. How up do you want to go? Like super up? Yes. Whoa. Right. Whoa, I didn't. Go that way. <laughs> Can you hold on? I'm big. I can't just get away that quick. There's stuff to do here. It's Fei Jai's birthday coming up, right? Tomorrow. Tomorrow. What? Throw an egg on his head. I'm not an idiot. <laughs> what are you whispering about? How old is Jay? You're gonna get me chicken nuggets, right? No, he said he's gonna put an egg on your head, actually. Okay, <laughs> Why would you do that? I have no allies here. Anthony's my only ally here. <laughs> chicken nuggets what? sound good, though. Dude, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Through chicken nugget. Look at the size of these altars. Guys, this is insane. And they are quarantined because they come in from very low pH, right? So they've yeah. been quarantined for about three months there to be able to take higher pH. But look at the size of these things, dude. They're super tall. Look. This is crazy. Every single one of them. This was me, though, Fajai. Give me credit. This was me. All right, I'll, you wanted the I'll little ones. Blend it, blend it the Just make sure that the fish is not in there. Wow. I would like to keep a tank of. of can they can we put all those and discus together? Yeah, definitely. Maybe. What do you guys think? Should we keep a tank in the exhibit for like large altums like this with discus? Let me know in the comments below. All right. Really pretty. Every single one of them. Now, all of them are fragile, right? So we have to do our medication, quarantining, to be able to keep them in good condition to be able to ship to you guys. What do you learn about the Altums through your lifetime, Big Jack? Can you please, please explain? Well, from what I've always known is that they're very sensitive fish, and in the early part of my oh hobby- Oh my God, look at the size of this oh, one. Geez. Sorry, sorry guys, <laughs> look at this. This is the biggest Altum we ever had. Yeah. Brian, look. Even Ryan got here. What is this, Ryan? Uh, a giant fish? A giant fish, yeah, <laughs> good job. Sorry, go ahead. All right, anyway. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> so traditionally, I've shied away from wild altums because I've always heard that they're very hard to keep, they're very sensitive. Um, but nowadays, what a lot of the exporters are doing is they don't ship it out right away. They pre-quarantine it, so they take out a lot of the hard work, um, or sorry, not take, yeah, they do a lot of the hard work for us, the ground, so, the ground work, yeah. Yeah. so it's a little bit easier for us. And as long as we acclimate them slowly and, and get them adjusted, I think they're much easier to care for nowadays. All right, so the fish are looking good. He won't leave me alone, so you might have to. Sorry, Anthony, you might take my spot. I'll just watch. That's how you get out of work, you what see? You have say, some Ryan? kids. What do we say? Just have some kids, you don't have to work. Thank you. Thank you. Come on, Ryan, let's, hey, go. let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. You like to work? Yes. Good, because your mommy doesn't. What we have here are the famous, famous, world famous. Oh, wait. <laughs> I got it. Oh, well. If he's not triple A quality? No. Oh. What we have here is the world famous. <laughs> Why did I deserve this? Panda you warus. You always throwing heat packs at me. That's right, true. guys? He's always throwing heat packs at me. Oh, small bags. Yeah, right. All right, it's, gonna, it's hard to see, so Wait, let's yeah. just cut them open. Hold on one second. We ordered two sizes. Yes, that's the next size. Okay, the, the next one is, is I so, hope it's just like that. So we got smaller ones Wait, and we got... Look, just look. I know, they're really nice. You can want to keep them. Yeah. <laughs> right? I can see it already. But I, I already see, I already know people watching this video will be like calling already. Look at wanting. the fins, bro. 
I know. It's not even all the way up. Yeah. Let me see it. Look, Ryan. <laughs> all right. Yeah, so, all Panda, you are rude. We're going to put them away. And we got to get to the other box. We, we got to get we to the will. other box. Patience is a virtue, and that's something I, you don't have. Can I buy it? Sure. I'll sell you some of mine. <laughs> well, you have too much patience. Yeah, that's why I can't afford to give some away. <laughs> Guys, sometimes, this is why we, we're good partners. And even Oi agrees. Look at her face. Just agree to it, okay, Oi? <laughs> agree. Fejai has 100% extra patience, <laughs> and I have none. So together, we're 50-50. There you so go. Every day he's pushing me, pushing me, pushing me. You hear that, right? I have, I have, I have so you much hear that, right? yeah. I'm put... Okay, all right. You said it, not me. I know. I know. Okay. I'll see you in the next box. Mm -hmm. That was Oi. I, I, I don't swear, but that was Oi. <laughs> you don't swear, so it's you. Guys. You gotta have fun. Oh, I thought you I thought you were gonna do it. I was ready to go. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, they don't look that big, big guy. They don't look that big. Well you ordered it, okay? <laughs> this is it? This is the last box? Uh, there's for them? one more. Right here. There's one more. The bag is big. But right. I mean the angel came in that bag. Alright, okay. so. Okay, all right, so it's it's big, it's big, it's big. Sorry, boss. <laughs> Sorry. It's big. Look at this. A lot of people are going to want these. That's decent. Oh, yeah, that's big. It's a good solid five, six inches. I would say five. Fins look good. Well, you know what five inches look like? No. That's the size that I like. <laughs> not too big, but not too small. That's the size that I like. We'll see you in another box. <laughs> There's something that I ordered that's not coming though. What is that? Daimara. Oh, yeah, it didn't come. But they they gave us something else that was, I think, cool. It's a good size. Yeah. Good size, perch lotus. Flag tails. Okay. So far, really nice shipment. Fish come in pretty healthy. Yeah. Oh. But I haven't, I still yeah. haven't seen what I really ordered, so. I did order the Altums. <clears throat> I ordered the Altums. No, you ordered the little Altums, medium I, size. I said I ordered Altums. I didn't say what size. Ooh. These are those like, it's like the hammerhead cat. Oh, they actually look pretty cool. Yeah. Okay, so the water's a little bad. You can see all this fun. Take picture. Hey, take picture of the fish. Take picture of the fish. Go, go, go. Do not have kids and sell fish at the same time, okay? I tell you, you're gonna lose it. Unless you have his patience. How can you get upset at children? Oh, easy. <laughs> daddy, <laughs> daddy, daddy. Fresh off of the hundreds, daddy. All right, let's see. Ryan Rohan. Uh, guys, they actually look super cool here. Come here to the table. They're called Bacon catfish, right? But these have a nice stripe, white and black stripes on them. It's hard to see. Here, let me put them in the tank. Oh. Saw that move? Just missed their face. Oh, fish eye. How many boxes have we done together already? Oh. How many? A lot, right? Too many. <laughs> Not, Too enough. Many. Not, Not enough. Not enough. What is it? What you got? Vampire? Yeah. Oh, you even eat these. Vampire Pleco. You can eat these, you said? No, we need these. Oh. It sounded like you said. Yeah. Oh, I'm like, <laughs> what the heck are you eating? Okay, so the difference between like a snowball and a vampire, I usually look at the face. You see how they have a pointy face? Yep. And these actually bite. I have had them bite me. You bit bi you before. Yeah. Have you got bitten by a vampire Pleco? Uh, I don't recall, so probably not. Maybe. Lisa did, because I, I remember yeah. one time. Um, but they do have, they, they are carnivorous. And I said that right. Ooh, I love it. Yeah, you can even make fun of me. <laughs> Let me put them with the Proch Lotus. It's actually a good size. About four inches, three and a half, four inches.
getting close to uh, feeding time here. Fajai is slowing down. It's time for my union sanctioned break. <laughs> I'll be right back. It's called Lo Mein. Right? Did they say right? Lo Mein. Lo Mein. Oh, mean. Get it's it. not Mein? No. Oh. In Chinese, we call it Lo Mein. Lo Mein. And it's just noodles. Yeah, Kwai Lo Lo Mein. I'm a white noodle. Uh -huh. Ah, see? I got it. I speak Chinese, mofo. What are these for China? Uh, I forgot. I'm getting old. <laughs> Oh, these are the, what you ordered, the bumblebee? Oh, the Zungar, the bumblebee. This is the giant bumblebee cats, oh. I think. Oh, is it? Okay. I think so, yeah. So, they should be able to go here while we're acclimating. We have only two gulpers, and I don't know why, because I ordered more. And I actually had ordered one giant one, or two giant ones, that it didn't come. That's what they call giant. No. It was supposed to be like... That says extra large. It's supposed to be 12 inches, okay. the ones I ordered. So, I'm going to have a talk with the supplier. I'm upset about that. These are actually really good size, these bumblebees. Right? Yeah. Look, take a look at them in the tank. All right, my people. This is getting close to the end here. So far, so good. I did a great job with the shipment. Right? I'll give you a, a well-deserved pat on the back. Oh. As long as it's just upper back. <laughs> oh. Okay. Wow, you ordered these? Good yeah. Job. Good job. It was a last-minute order. I didn't even know he had them. It's a good size. Yeah. I Perfect coloration. Beautiful jaguar catfish. All right, it's going to go in here. Yeah. All right, so we got two bags of jaguar. Guys, these little guys don't last, so if you like them, Get them quick because they yeah. usually go pretty quick, right? Yeah. Here, use your nail and open the bag because I can't do it. I don't have a long nail. He does. You don't need a nail. You know how like usually people have like a crack nail, like a long one? Hey Jai, what do you have the long nail for? It's not a long nail. It's just I don't trim it like all the way all the way down. I leave a little bit. Yeah, a little bit. It's like a girl nail. I eat my nails. There you go. Well, I don't. I pick it. But you, you know, like some guys have leave a crack nail, right? Oh yeah. It's a booger nail. Yeah, in Asia, it's a booger nail also. <laughs> yeah, that really good. So. <laughs> so there's a one bo one bag of these guys that look pretty beat up, right? And. After doing so many acclimations, we learned catfish, even though they look so bad, we can't go fast because the pH change will kill them. So we left the, the stream really slow and we gave them plenty of oxygen and they came back around. Right? Right. So I think every time we actually learn, every time we do an unboxing, we learn as well because sometimes we get like, oh man, the fish is gonna die and we try to go fast, we end up killing the fish. So this, this system right here works pretty well for that. I love unboxing. So much fun to see like different fish. Even though fish they've seen before, sometimes you get stuff like this, and you're like, damn, I just like eat. So it's cool. Even the leperinas, I don't think I've ever seen them before. With the reddish? Yeah, with the orange. It's actually orange. Oh, orange. Okay. I don't know what these are. Jelly? Oh, this. This is different for you guys. It's actually pretty cool. Let's let's open yes. it. Let's put it in the this table. Is, this is a it's, a it's a wood cat also, but it's a striped wood cat. Yeah, That's not table. commonly available. You use your crack now? Yes, of course. <laughs> you get it. Oh man, he would fail on the contest. Look at that. <laughs> All right, but they look like they're a driftwood cat that actually moves around a lot. They don't just sit still. They got a more elongated body. Yeah. Let me try to pull one out. Hold on. Hard to see. Whoa, it's actually I like these fish a lot, dude. They're pretty cool. Can you get like a white tub? Boss, yeah. can you give me a white tub, please? A white? Yeah. I want to show everybody these fish. They look pretty. They have like an eel body with a catfish face. And the fins are really long. Yeah. What made you order these? This is the first time I've seen them. Uh, first time also. He offered to me last minute also. And then I said, okay. 
Hold on, hold on. Let's put it here. I, I really want to see them up close. We got to study fish when it's the first time we see them, you know? Thank you, boss. Just one. one. All right. So, as I was saying, let's get the light on it. Let's get this big guy. Look how long the fins are. No, uh, not that one. This guy. I like this one. But look how long every single fin. I, I like, I like the anal fin. You see how it opens up? It's, it's kind of looks like the planiceps with yeah, that butterfly yeah, yeah. wing. But look at the fins though. It's like an eel body, right? Look at the fins on the bottom, like an arowana. Mm -hmm. And then the face is so cool. I don't think these hide that much. I think they right. drift with caps that move around. I'm gonna have a conspiracy theory here. Mm. So you see how I have the elongated body and the white stripe, and it has this big, um, well, I guess that's the anal fin, right? The big anal fin? Uh -huh. Maybe somewhere along the line, this is like ancestors to how planiceps became that had that elongated look with the white stripe and the same thing, that the butterfly wings. Yeah, yeah, right? it could it's be. a lot of similarities there. They have the driftwood face, but the planiceps body. Pretty cool. That, this is a cool evolution. <laughs> I gotta tell you, I don't know if this one is my favorite or the Altums right now. All right, guys, we're gonna be doing this quick because Fajai oh. is hungry. Oh. Yeah. Oh. They're okay. They're like what, Beautiful. 11? Yeah. 12? Okay. Yeah. Nice fans. Good. Okay. Everyone is actually a very tough fish. Sometimes when people call us. When people call and say, I lost marijuana, it's hard to know because they're, they're tough. 95% of the time, you lose it from jumping out. Yeah. Right. This was one of my first fish also when I first started. And no matter how tight you cover the tank, they'll find that little hole where you put the airline through or the canister filter, and they just work their way right through that. And like I don't understand how they do it either. Like they know that's the spot. Or I'm thinking maybe that at night, like that's where they see a little bit of light. I always tell people, leave a night light on because then you prevent fish from getting spooked, you prevent fish from attacking each other. If not 100%, at least a good amount. What's the other one? 19? Babies, Airwanas. Well, we did have a lot of people asking for, for smaller yeah. size, so. Don't put them on top. Look how big they are. Show, show them big guys. Yeah, they're small. But I like them. This is a, a size when they're still like really cute. <laughs> They're monster fish, but look cute. Like the baby red tail. Yeah, and at this size, they have like that orange and blue little spot on their, behind their heel. Look at Fiji getting little... all sensitive now. You talk about me. Well, no, I mean, this is the stuff that I used to look for when I would buy oh. fish. But you never really heard me say a fish is cute. That's not true. I never said that. You can't get over this. So those little baby that's, are that's handsome. How can a baby arrow find this? Are they cute? They're baby red tails? They're... You won't admit it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, they are cute. Oh, oh no. Oh, shit, you okay? Are you okay? <laughs> this was linked to that. He caught himself really good. Oh my god, bro. Crazy, man. You did pretty good, though. Time to take a, take a break. Why are you for, for a chicken nugget? <laughs> I found something today. I'm not as athletic as Fajai. What just happened? I think you stepped on a plastic bag that yes. you left on the floor. He stepped on a plastic bag that he left on the floor and he slipped on it and landed on the phone box. Which I think is good because if not, you would have hit yourself on the raft. I actually did. I'm okay, buddy. Can I have a kiss? No. Oh. Thank you. I thought he was asking me for the kiss. Oh, Holy Jesus. crap. So slippery. <laughs> that one hurt. That one hurt more than, than the fall. Enough fun. <laughs> that wasn't fun. That was fun. <laughs> it was like karma after I fell and then you fell. <laughs> what is that? It's so coincidental that people might think it's staged. <laughs> you know it I mean? was not staged. I, I wish I would have filmed it. I know. If it was thing. staged, we would have filmed it. Yeah. Did you film him? Who? No. Falling? Yes, no. I got him. Oh, you got me? Okay. I think so. I just happened to already have it on. Okay, so these are the tiger Ow. severs. <laughs> You're right. Oh my. It was it was the ladder. The, at the end, well, I hit the, the ladder. End, yeah. When you slipped again? You, you need better shoes then. I do. Those Converse don't cut it. Hey, Jai, don't pay me enough. All right, what is this? Ooh. Tiger Karari Sevens. So They're showing a lot of red right spots. Yeah, do we have these here or no? Um, we have bigger ones, but we don't have this size. So, so this is for the Right now, they don't look that nice. Let's put them in a tank and see how really nice they will look. Really? I think they look great. Look at all They're those red spots. They're pale right now. Yeah, but they're pale. The, the right. colors usually show yeah, really nice. It's too late to put it in there, right? Yeah. Can we start another tank? Well, Will they mess with them? Who's going up there? 
I'll put it there on. Yeah, put there on. Don't fall. No. no. That, that thing is slippery. Yeah. Okay. Will they will they try to eat the arowana? They shouldn't. So I know people are gonna ask, what's all this little black stuff in the bag? Um, that's carbon actually. The exporter uses carbon. I personally don't agree with it, but they like to use it and if I tell them what to do and stuff arrives dead, then I can't claim DOA. I mean, nothing arrives dead, but then no, it's, a, it it's a pain really in the good. butt because we got to clean all that up later. Yes. And the one thing that they don't realize is that when you use freshly activated carbon, it actually absorbs oxygen out of the water. That's why when, when you first wash carbon, you hear that fizzle, right? And so if we're putting fish in a bag and we're pumping oxygen and they have limited oxygen, you throw fresh carbon, that's going to suck out all the air. I just think it's contradictory. So usually... What's happening today? So usually carbon takes chemicals out of the water. Yes, it takes chemicals out of the water, but when you first use it, that first time... But they're using time, it trying to take ammonia out of the water. Does it work? Not ammonia, but it'll, it'll remove like dissolved organics. It'll keep the water cleaner, but it doesn't do anything for ammonia. Okay. Yeah. All right. So all things are looking good. There's only one laying down, but so far so good. Panda Yorus, some nice sized ones. So far, it's a good shipment of those fish, man. I love these guys. It's so cool. These are actually... They're legal in some states, right? All right. So, oh, dude. All right. So there's a couple of species of wolffish. I'm not even going to BS anymore. But there's a lot of scales in this tank, in this bag. And they kind of went out of the way. They look like they did. But these, I think these are the golden. All right. So we're going to gonna have to find out. Wolf. I ordered a few species of wolffish just so you guys can see a variety of them. But I don't remember what they are. Yeah, so, this has to be the black. Yeah, so these are the black, and it's five golden and five of the common. So this is common, this is golden, so we can figure it out. But let's check out the blacks. So which one do you think it gets bigger, the black or the MR? The MR, right? Mm -hmm. I think so. But the black looks like an MR too. I mean, they're all similar, they're cousins. They. So, wow, look at the markings on the head. Yeah, this is definitely not MR. So we got black wolf, golden wolf. I want to open the golden. You can put them in there for now, right? I guess. They look the same size. All right, so let's open this one so we can see the difference. Three black wolf, five golden. And the golden, they put them in the same bag, so they beat each other up. We're going to have to take a little time to acclimate. And then smaller size. Actually, you can put them all in there. Where's the scissor, Fake Jai? Amaras are coming. If you're looking for Amaras, we have another shipment coming in with marble motorals and um, flower rays. So we have Amaras as well coming in. Let's put these guys in here. We're not going to be able to tank them together because you can tell they're a little smaller than the other ones. But I think the blacks with the goldens, we should be able to put it together, no? The black with the golden, maybe. But look at the markings, bro. That thing looks just mean. There's something really nice here that we just skipped it. Oh yeah, it's two pieces. It was it was stuffed into the box. Where Guys, can we put it? this is actually pretty cool. I don't know where to put it. They're huge. Where should we put it, Fiji? And yeah, what is it? Uh, larger type flurry. Wow, this is a very pretty fish. Very pretty fish. All right, there's three boxes left, but we're so hungry, we're not even gonna waste time going up there. None of that fancy stuff. We're just gonna go right here. Don't fall. I'm not falling. I'm just hungry. All right. I'm, a, I'm disappointed. I'm disappointed because I ordered a giant pleco, like 70 centimeters, and it didn't come. Either didn't come or that man right there told him not to shit. I knew it. Really pretty fish, but I, like I said, I really wanted a large one. Wait, that sounded so weird. <laughs> The fish, the fish. Yeah, of course the fish. Wait, what's in there? Same? Uh, the jelly cats. You want to just open it and show yeah. everybody? Yeah. You want to eat. So we got two of those Titan Flecos. Was freight expensive on them? Uh, yeah, Columbia's not too bad. But they charge us too much for them, right? We got to yeah. talk to them, okay. Because they, I think they charge us for the, the big ones. So put them on the website. Still, very pretty fish. I was just expecting a giant. So these are jelly cats. 
And if you can't see it right now, you're gonna have to see it once they're in the tank because we're gonna put everything away and start eating because I'm starving. Boy, are you hungry? A little bit. A little bit. When she says little bit, that means a lot. <laughs> All right, guys, so it's the end of the day. We have to start putting this fish away, but I just want to show it to you now that they're all acclimated. Over here, we have baby silver iguanas with some tiger kararis. In here, we got black wolf fish, golden wolf fish, and some common wolf fish, smaller little guys right there. Two titans. Yep. Right? Even though I ordered a much larger one, these two came in. We got some jelly cats. And here, a lot of people's favorite, the Panda Uaru. We got some really nice size ones. Things look great, look super healthy. Some smaller ones as well. This is probably my favorite of the entire shipment. The large Altums. Extra, extra large. What do you think, Vijay? It's definitely the size of your hand. Right? It's up there. Right. They're pretty big. All right, and then here we got the flag tail perch lotus with some uh, vampire placos, two large tiger kararis, jaguar catfish, and what was the name of these guys? Striped woodcat. Striped woodcat. Super cool. They look like they have a body of a eel and like fins like a planiceps. Super cool fish. And uh, here we have the orange leperinas. Do you remember the name or no? No, I don't. They just called it special leperinas. Special leperinas. Look at their their face is so weird. Look at the mouth. It's like an anteater. Yeah. But so far I don't see them nitpicking on anybody, so yeah. let's see. We got the blue phantoms. The what is this? Panda corridors? Uh Adolfoy. Adolfoy? And then we have, are these red tail or yellow tail? We can uh, figure out. Yellow tail. So we'll supposed... trust the supplier. All right, yellow tail barracudas, green phantoms, high fin green phantoms. And then here we have a different type of wood catfish. A hammerhead. Hammerhead. But this is not the regular brown one. This is super no, cool. There's different types, yeah. So if you guys are looking for a predatory fish that doesn't get that big, these guys will do the trick. And then we have the bumblebee cats. And some larger silver one so overall it was a pretty good shipment yeah it's a nice well-rounded shipment you know keep our tanks full so that you guys have fish right and then uh we are pretty stuck up and we got to make space for these guys yeah and we have more fish coming in so when's the next shipment uh in about five hours <laughs> <laughs> we gotta go we got a lot to do so thanks for watching let us know in the comments below which one was your favorite fish i have mine over there what was yours i think it's these leperinas Lepre ah, yeah. or, or, top, or, or these new striped wood cats. That's true. What was your favorite fish? Angel? Angel, right, yeah. Babe, what was your favorite fish? Um, I think... Jaguar, Jaguar, yes, Jaguar. Jaguar. You like always Jaguar cats? I love the Jaguars, yes. The little cats over here? Yep, they're always my favorite. I love the patterns. But, what look like boxes? but these... Well, these are really cool. But we uh, haven't had those in a while. Yeah. Yeah. All right. So let us know in the comments below, guys. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the next unboxing.